Sparkle Squad. This is Monica and I have Sir Sparkles. He's standing over here to my right and I found my pink and blue Christmas lights from my Christmas tree that I had in Texas. So I thought I would just go ahead and put them on my dream box this year. I mean, why not? I haven't put up an actual Christmas tree this year just because of the situation with my job and everything. And I've kind of not felt like putting a tree up. But when I found these lights, I thought, why not just get out Sir Sparkles, who has his own ready-made and sparkletastic Christmas tree, mind you. So we're going to just kind of pan up here and... <laughs> Yes, it looks tacky because they're not white strings of light, but I used my handy dandy little 3M command hooks to hang those lights up. And then I put some lights in behind where I have normally got my little jewelry boards there so that it gives a little extra lighting in the background. And then all of my little papers are in. Now, I don't have my Christmas papers put in because, again, you know, Kind of bah humbugging it, I guess, this Christmas season. But, you know, at least I got some, some lights and some sparkles here with me. I did a little bit of a Thanksgiving shopping spree, okay, at a few select beading companies. <laughs> One of which is Softflex. I got this because, you know, I'm a sucker for the Nutcracker, obviously. And she had put together a Nutcracker collection. Or design challenge kit, rather. I'm sorry. I'm saying that wrong. And my little uh, cousin, I just call her my niece because I grew up with her mother. Like, we were sisters. Little Miss Evie. She is in the Nutcracker there in Tennessee. If you're going to the Tennessee Theater here in the next couple of days for December 2022, she is going to be one of the little mice in the program. And I just love that. It, the Tennessee Theater, the... Um, main experiences I've had there going to the Harry Connick Jr. concerts yes my poor friend Cheryl should uh, should remember those very well bless her heart I've got their mystery design kit for the Nutcracker theme from Softflex so yay I'm so excited to open that up and then I also purchased some other goodies here I got one of their mystery bags and their metallics duos in the copper and antique brass so I wanted to show you what I have now I think I may have every color known to man or at least known to Softflex community I don't know because I have two drawers full and yet I still keep buying more but I have the copper color right here um, I just fell in love with that color look at that and then this is the antique brass color those beautiful colors so this is the 49 strands and get the 26 pound test it's you can actually also tie knots in this but this is just a 10 foot spool you can order them in different lengths and different colors so i love to do with the, the pink rotocrosite and she has her big sales on there i go and i load up on that because that's my signature color you know that and the turquoise blue but well actually i, I don't think it's turquoise blue turquoise blue for them looks more like a greenish blue and then i wind up really i think it's topaz I think it might be topaz blue is what is my actual version of blue or as close to it as I can get. But you know, I love it all. Let's rip into this, shall we? This is like a Christmas gift. I love it. So this is the mystery bag and it's like a grab bag. And I can't remember. It seemed like it was on sale or something was going on. I can't remember. Anyway, I know I just, I needed it in my life and it was after Thanksgiving. So there you go. That's what I did. I'm in love already. I haven't even opened everything yet. Okay, so there's the colors, and those colors coordinate beautifully. So I think that's probably what they were doing. So this is from the outlet, and this is sterling silver wire, 19 strands. And this is, it even tells you, for soft materials, so that's really cool. 13 pounds, it's not anything that's really heavy. You can still tie the knots in there, but look at that. And then look at these beads. Ooh, so I don't know, is this like a purple color? or mauve or I don't know what color that is oh my gosh oh they're silky smooth look at that and there's a ton of them oh those are beautiful oh I'm so glad I got this because I don't have anything like that but that is a ton of beauty right there what color is that so as I'm turning it around in the light sometimes it kind of looks bronze then it has an element of purple. Then it kind of looks like a deep mauve. 
Uh, there's a, just a wee hint of periwinkle in there, it looks like. Oh my gosh, but the thing that I love the most is how they feel on the strand. I mean, I could just wear that as a necklace right there, and that is so fabulous just to feel it. It's so smooth. These beads are just a long cylindrical bead, and it's, I think we call those bugle beads. But, I mean, they're so smooth. They're not anything jutting out and, you know, cutting me on the edge or anything like that. So, you could just literally make a necklace just like that, and it would be beautiful. Wow. Aw, looky. Two pink stars. I think these are ceramic. Aren't those beautiful? These are some beautiful pink beads. Like a powder pink, sort of. You know, like a really baby pink. And they are transparent, so it's hard to see, I guess. Very pretty. Oh, there's one. <laughs> my lights are coming on in my gloves. Sorry about that. But yeah, isn't that awesome? And then we have a purple version, but it is a barrel kind of bead, it looks like. And that is a purple color. Isn't that beautiful? And that coordinates with that strand, so I'm thinking this might be purple. I don't know, it just picks up a lot of different colors when I was looking at it. And then, ooh, these are pretty. Oh, let's open this one up and pull out a few, shall we? So this is, gosh, and that's a lot of them. Look at that, that pink. Nice, large cylinder beads. Very pretty beads right there. <laughs> this is so cute. I love this. I am just so tickled every time that I get uh, one of her packages. And it's just wrapped so simply. But I, it just makes me so happy. And, you know, if I had a beading company, that's what I would do. Because it's sometimes it's just the smallest things that just make you so happy. The Lord knows we need it now, don't we? Ooh, my goodness. And this lovely bag is the Nutcracker Design Kit. And it says everything that it contains here on this paper. And if I had opened it fast enough, I would have been able to use the coupon code that was on the other side. This is the Champagne Bead Stringing Wire. And this is 10 feet of the 19 strand. This is also for like a glass, mineral, and metal bead that you can use all purpose. Abrasion resistant. This is a pretty kind of a light gold champagne -y beige color. Very versatile. Ooh, yes, we've got some beautiful beads over here, these strands. So this is the four millimeter green with gold check glass faceted rounds. And I love that. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Let's see if you can see that. Such beautiful sparkle on that. And then we have a five millimeter light blue check glass faceted round. And oops, I didn't notice the blue until I put it on my glove because away from that, it kind of looked white <laughs> to me at first glance. So let's look here. Wee! Very pretty. Very nice pale blue color, but it still has some fire. And then we've got a six millimeter red check glass faceted round. Looks like rubies, or well, you know, ruby sleepers. Very sparkly and red. And a five by three millimeter red check glass faceted rondelle. I love rondelle beads, they're so versatile. Then we have the Jesse James bead mix in Nutcracker. And look at these cool colors, man. Now, I also had a Jesse James beads uh, purchase spree with their sales as well around Thanksgiving. I got such an awesome buy with their pie kit. I don't know if anybody else saw that, but oh my gosh. I had rewards points and I just ate it up. Ha 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 ha, yeah. So these are so pretty together, all these colors. Because I would never think to put some of these colors with each other. But when you see it in the bag like this, it all makes sense. And then we have the charms. Wow, so they're not silver and gold, but they are a an oxidized brass charm by Vintage. We have a separate bag of crimp tubes so that I can put things together. We've got some ear wires. We've got a ballerina slipper. We've got the ballerina. And oh, we've got the nutcracker. Beautiful charms. And I love how the slippers are 3D. I hope that Miss Evelyn 
has an excellent time as one of the little nutcracker mice. And I'm sorry I won't be able to come and see it, but I know that your mother is going to film it six ways of Sunday. <laughs> and I hope that you have a beautiful time in this experience because you so deserve it. And she is very talented, Miss Evelyn is, in her dancing skills. Beautiful ballerina she is. So enjoy your time, Miss Evelyn, and congratulations. I'm looking forward to creating some goodies with this, and I hope that you stick around in... I don't know why the name is not on this spool, but it's a beautiful aqua blue color. Very nice, and it fit in lovely with the color scheme. If you liked this video, please give me a thumbs up and share this with any of your friends that might be interested in jewelry making supplies from softflex.com or any anything that I have here on my channel as I love to share. And if you've not already done so, please subscribe to my channel. And as always, thank you so much for watching and have a sparkle day, y'all. Bye!